Right, what is liquidation? I'll tell you the definition that I found on Google. Liquidation in finance and economics is the process of bringing a business to an end and distributing its assets to claimants. It's an event that usually occurs when a company is insolvent, meaning it cannot pay its obligations when they are due. As company operations end, the remaining assets are used to pay creditors and shareholders based on the priority of their claims. Right. So in the UK today, really, there's three types of liquidation. Number one is a creditor's voluntary liquidation. And that's when a business cannot afford to pay its debts, its uh, liabilities are more than its assets. And what they do, you, the director goes voluntarily to a licensed insolvency practitioner and asks them to close that business down. Okay. The liquidator is appointed. If there's any assets, they get they get sold and the, the funds get distributed to, to creditors of the company. If there's no assets uh, in the business, the business's debts get written off and the company gets formally closed down. Number two is a compulsory liquidation. Unlike where a director has voluntarily gone to a liquidator and said, listen, it's the end of the line. I need to put this into company liquid uh, voluntary liquidation. This director, um, some would say, has buried their heads in the sand and not done anything. And eventually, one of the company creditors has issued a winding up petition and forced that company into liquidation. In a compulsory liquidation, you lose all control. You don't um, choose the, the liquidator that you'd like to appoint. Um, you get your winding up petition on the doorstep. You get your day in court. And and in court, your your company's forced into liquidation. Now, in forced liquidation scenarios, the official receiver will get appointed and sometimes they will give that job out to um, a licensed insolvency practitioner that's just on the rotor. Okay. The third thing is called a member's voluntary liquidation or an MVL to short for short. This is a solvent liquidation. So let's say that your business uh, has money in the bank. You can pay off all its debts and you've still got, say, over £25,000 left in the bank. A member's voluntary liquidation could be the right option for you um, because it could be the most tax efficient way to withdraw that money from the business bank account. So I hope you found that informed. Three types in the uh, in the three types of liquidation in the UK. If you enjoy our videos, please subscribe to the channel, like the video, drop us any questions in the comments below. Many thanks, Chris Worden.